Okay, so that is the VA Medical Center right there. Across the street, there's no neighbors, it's a pond. There is street parking here. And this is not a double. Let me zoom out there. This is not a double, and it looks way bigger than what it looks like. So basically, shared wall right there. This side goes back very far, and then the left side here is owned by someone else. But can't really see it from the ground, but we do have a new roof on the top, and there is a fenced-in backyard. Next, we'll go inside and take a look. All right, here, just walk through the front door here. It's a split level, so you can go up or down. And like I said, from the street, it doesn't look big, but it is a big house here. Updated ceiling fan in here. Uh, this is linoleum, sheet linoleum flooring. Uh, that is an original window. That was an original window. Hello. Uh, dining room here, linoleum here. And this is uh, LVP flooring in here. Painted kitchen cabinets. Uh, the updated flooring in here, new countertops. Are the appliances yours? Yeah. Okay, and the appliances are the tenants. Then pantry closet over here. Then two bedrooms on this level. Get a light here. Bathroom here, updated flooring in here, updated vanity, updated toilet. It's like updated surround with an original tub. Is it okay to go in the bedrooms? Oh yeah, okay. it's just a little messy in here. That's okay. That's like our closet area. And then bedroom, I don't know, we'll call it bedroom number one. This does have a new window in here, sliding closet over here. And this is like an area rug in here, but it has linoleum flooring also. And then linen closet right here. Then the second bedroom, double sliding door in here. And both of these windows are new. They still have the sticker on here and linoleum flooring in here. This is a area rug that's the tenants. Next, I'll meet you down on the lower level. All right, so here we just came down to the lower level here and most of the lower level has that sheet linoleum in here as well. This is bedroom number three. And really most of the bedrooms are good sized here. <laughs> Look a little pink from the light in here, but the paint is kind of the same paint as upstairs. It's like a yellowish, that kind of uh, yellow cream um, closet over there. And that is another door to get into the bedroom. So there's two doors to get into the bedroom. Um, and I believe that is a new window back there. And then coming into our utility room that's under the stairs storage here. Um, washer and dryer are the tenants. Furnace, I think is like a year old on the furnace in the air conditioner. And the water heater is I think only a couple years old as well on the water heater. And that is uh, just all storage back there. Then garage and it was talked about at one time possibly converting this to a fifth bedroom um, which could no heat source in it currently but could actually be a fifth bedroom here and then that's the other door to that bedroom that we already saw and then a second full bathroom here a new LVP in the bathroom updated uh, vanity updated commode and all new shower in here. And then we have a fourth bedroom over here. So we don't have a light in here, but same paint throughout the whole house. Uh, obviously they're using it as an office. That is a new window here as well. And then give you a peek to the backyard. Backyard is fenced. Yes, this is a new window. Sticker still in it. Backyard is completely fenced. That area there's for like a, an old pool. So not a huge backyard, but all fenced in and a nice backyard here. Closet over here for this. So currently four bedrooms, two baths with a dining room. And like I said, could potentially make a fifth bedroom here if you so chose to.